Hello watch enthusiasts. My name is OJ Watley and I'm here to talk to you about an amazing Cartier watch. A Cartier Pasha GMT Dual Time Big Date. If you like our watch videos, please make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel, Watch You Want Inc. That is the very best way to receive timely updates of our most recently posted videos. Additionally, if you'd like to view this watch or any of the watches in our current inventory, you may go to our website, www.watchyouwant.com, where you can view this watch and our entire inventory of watches in real time, high visibility photos, and detailed descriptions. So I have the pleasure of speaking with you today about the Cartier Pasha XL Big Date GMT. This is an incredible watch featuring a 42 millimeter 18 karat rose gold case. You know, for years, Cartier has been trying to reinvent itself from a standard jewelry company to a more formidable watchmaking house. And this is one of its uh, forays into that sort of whore horological, haute horological uh, watchmaking class of watches, if you will. This is a limited edition Cartier Pasha 42 featuring a dual time complication with a big date and a day night indicator. I happen to love this watch because I love the rosy 18 karat rose gold case accented by this sort of antique brown or tobacco brown, uh, highly finished hand guilloche dial with a cutout for the big date at 12 and another cutout for the day or night indication um, at six o'clock. Love those 18 karat rose gold uh, dolphin hands and very elegant GMT indicator. To me, this is just a gorgeous watch that while it's utilitarian and being able to track a second time zone, really is just an elegant and classy timepiece that is really quite special in its complication. So as we discussed, this watch has a grand guichet double digit or big date indication squarely at 12 o'clock. And again, going with that theme of brown and not quite ivory, not quite, definitely not white, but really sort of that almost parchment or sand color um, in the motif and matching the AM PM indicator is that date wheel. Those double digit date wheels are not white, but they're actually sort of a, a parchment or a, not, a, I wouldn't say an ivory, but more of a beige with a very clear and very bold Arabic numerals for the uh, date indication. I really love that theme of brown and sort of off-white, uh, sort of that, 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 that aged brown. Um, to me, it, it, it seems like it's sort of like an Egyptian homage type watch between the guilloche on the dial and sort of the um, detailing on, that day, on the uh, day and night uh, wheel at six o'clock. So the way this watch works is, you know, you've got your central time indicated by the traditional hour and minute hands. And then of course you've got the date and then you've got your day and night indicator um, at six o'clock on the dial. It's a large cutout. It's not quite a complete semicircle, but the idea is there's a little triangle right in the middle and whatever that triangle is pointing to is whether it's day or night. In this case, we're showing 920 and there's a sun coming up which is indicative that this watch is actually displaying a home time of 9.20 a.m. and not p.m. And I'm just gonna show you the difference here. Uh, if I can just get this little winding crown out. Excuse me one second while I leave frame. So, uh, what you'll see when you go to adjust this watch is that that day-night indicator is aligned to the hour and the minute hands. And so as you can see, as we get to three o'clock, you can see it's daylight going into dusk and you have that date indicate that day night disc as it's rotating going from shades of lighter brown to shades of darker brown to indicate night. And as soon as we hit six o'clock, you're gonna start seeing the moon. And there you have it starting the moon starting to come up. Now, as you can see, while we move the minute hand, which moves the hour hand, the GMT hand is rotating. 
The way this watch works is in the second position, because I'm in the furthest out position, the third position, but in the second position, when we move the crown counterclockwise, when we rotate the crown counterclockwise, it advances the date, and while we move the crown clockwise, it advances the GMT hand. The way this watch is designed is that while you're traveling, you are going to maintain your home time and you are going to address just the GMT knowing that wherever you are, if it's 10 o'clock or 11 o'clock, because that is your reference time or where you are, you don't need to have an AM or PM indication associated with that time because again, that's where you are. The AM and PM indication is most important to be indicative of your home time where you left so you don't end up calling the kids at four o'clock a.m. as opposed to four o'clock p.m. to find out how their day at school went. Um, so again, you've got this nice, you know, signature Pasha crown that screws down with that cabochon sapphire tipped on that. And again, what I love about this watch is that gorgeous, guilloche brown dial with all those various shades of beige and brown. Just so sublime, so elegant against the rose gold case. It's a 42 millimeter case size, which in my, uh, in my opinion is just a perfect case size. Still meant to be elegant and at the same time somewhat sporty. And what's neat about this watch is it features a see-through case back where you can view the movement, you can view the winding rotor. The back says Pasha de Cartier um, automatic without any kind of special engravings or anything along those lines. But this is in fact, you know, their uh, foray into the Haute Horologerie line and this is an in-house movement for them. Um, let's see, so 42 millimeter case, 18 karat rose gold, and we've got a gorgeous original Patek Philippe antique brown alligator strap accented by a gorgeous 18 karat rose gold folding deployment buckle. Here's what the watch looks like on my puny seven and a quarter inch wrist. And I still say it's a perfect size. Let's see if I can get that on there. So there you have it. Let's see, get it in the frame. Let's see. So there you have it. That's the Cartier Pasha XL Big Date GMT. Reference W3030001. It's an automatic movement and features a GMT complication as well as a day-night indicator and big date grand guichet double digit date window. Please make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel Watch You Want Inc. if you enjoy our videos. That is the very best way for you to be updated of our newly posted videos. Additionally, Please check out this watch and our entire inventory of watches on our website, www.watchyouwant.com. Thank you so very much for your time today. And as, as always, please wear your watches in the best of health. This is OJ Watley for Watch You Want, signing off. Have a great day.